<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, still in quarantine. I'm still working though, but it's the weekend, so I can film some YouTube videos. I don't normally do this, so it's just something new. We're gonna be talking about TikTok and how it's pretty good. Now, from what I've seen on Twitter, because I spend most of my time on Twitter when I'm on social media, like 90% of it, I see that there's many people saying that it's like a like a not cool thing, like it's just it's just whatever, you know, like it's for kids or something. And you know, for the most part last year, I was like, yeah, it's probably just that or something kind of cringy like that. There, shit. but honestly, it's not too bad. I mean, yes, yeah, so you'll have like the weird stuff, but which part of the internet does not have that, right? Like YouTube has it. Everyone on YouTube, everyone on Twitter is weird. So why, you know, I find it kind of weird that people say it's weird on TikTok. Now, I think people have the general idea that it's, well, at least, at least people in my age, people think it's, like, for kids. But, you know, I don't think it's that. I think it's just, maybe it's just a new thing that, well, it seems pretty new. I don't know how long it's been here. I think it's been probably four or five years it's been out. I don't know. I think it was used to be Musical.ly or some whatever it was called, but now it's this. And they did a really good job of rebranding themselves and something way better. And, you know, because obviously now everyone seems to have it. And that's a good thing because now small creators have the chance of making really good content that they like to a much bigger audience. Like, like the reach is insane. They don't understand how much reach it is on there. You know, you know, you could make a skit with your friend and it could have like over a thousand views within that night. Like that's, that's really good. So I think it's really good for small creators to have it. You know, a lot of people collab on there. You can make collabs. You could find ways to leverage that crowd you get to a much bigger audience right you can like move them on to youtube or maybe you're trying to sell maybe you create craft crafty stuff maybe you can redirect that card into whatever business you're doing right maybe you're running a business and if you record i guarantee you i guarantee you if you were to record a video like once a day like you know for the whole year i guarantee you one of those videos if you put some effort into it you could get it up you know get a lot of views on it i'm pretty sure that's how it would be i see a lot of streamers like uh, twitch streamers that will go on there that I, that I don't really know of and they'll put you know will make a video about themselves and it got to me so now i know that they're there and if i want to see the content i can follow them on twitch and now they have some leverage now i think it's great for you small creators to you know start doing this because you know i don't i don't think i don't think people understand like they can seriously move into this like um the most famous one being charlie the milio right she's a dancer i think she blew up like earlier this year like the beginning of it so just imagine if you do something and something some niche that many, many people know but you do it and then it gets discovered so then you make this really good content and then it blows up all of a sudden like that could really put yourself in a good you know place now, that can happen in, you know, Twitter and YouTube, like, you know, a good retweet from somebody can just make waves of different people following you or whatever, right? Like Nico Lowe or someone making really good viral content. But I think TikTok has the best reach possible for anyone to make, you know, to make the farthest amount of leaps because even on Twitter or YouTube, they'll, you know, they'll reach TikToks over there. So it's not like... It stops there. Like people will share your stuff and go you know, all across other platforms. So it's really good for getting like a view of what you're doing, right? That being a business, that being a Twitch streamer, that being side hustle, whatever, right? It's a good way to market yourself. Now I don't know the community too much, but I think it's it's fairly good. Um, I think it's actually pretty good. I know it's a pretty early to say that, but. From what I've seen, the community seems pretty well. Like, I, I know that a lot of people, you know, there's always going to be negative, there's always going to be haters. There's always going to be haters, no matter where you go. I don't, I don't, I do not expect that not to happen, but I think the community is pretty well over there. Now, I could be completely wrong, but I think it looks pretty solid from what I've seen. Like, I see a lot of collabs from people. A lot of people mention other people, right? So, and not to mention on TikTok itself, there's a, a way to react to other things. So, it's a way to, you know, Collab with Ivan intentionally collabing. You can collab with somebody, react to a video, and you are both, you know, getting a good good benefits out of it. Now, do I think TikTok will be here forever? 
No, not necessarily. I don't think it'll be here like I think YouTube will be here forever for a long time or that that kind of media where you could upload videos that are 5, 10, 15 minutes long. Right, content like that. But I don't think TikTok. TikTok will probably go away. Not soon. But it'll probably come back in a different form. Like this kind of like Vine-ish era kind of stuff. But in that sense, like, just like how Vine was really popular and there were some really good content creators. From from what I follow or from what I look, I haven't seen many Vine people come out of that and succeed that well. So TikTok's a w great way for you to start doing something and get a small crowd going and then from there, do something that you like that will further on your career, not having to depend on the sociability of TikTok being alive or not. So I think it's a great way to start. If you're watching, if you've made it this far, thank you for watching. I still work. I still work during this quarantine, but we'll be, I think I'll be shutting down pretty soon. Not that you care, but yes, I'll be shutting down soon.